Because of injuries and concussions, former Seahawks star Lofa Tatupu gained about 50 pounds after retiring from the NFL, but now he has started a company that he hopes prevents pain, whether you're a former athlete or not. It embraces CBD and hemp, and he says it has changed his life. Our own Steve Bunin went one-on-one -on -one with Lofa to talk about his journey. When do you remember was your first concussion? My fault. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> no, uh, so I was, uh, I think, freshman year. Uh, we were playing the Franklin Panthers, and um, yeah, there was a. I was going for a first down, and I dove, and you know, there's like two or three guys that got me pretty good, and just got up a little woozy, and uh, you know, but made it back to the huddle. Right. And then when you finished playing, what? How did you see yourself physically change, and maybe mentally over the years? Oh, physically and mentally, the um, you know that, that's all trauma you're going through. Whether it's an ankle sprain or a broken ankle, uh, it was about 10 surgeries I want to say over the course of my career, and which ultimately led to my career only being six years. Um, so uh, just it felt like going through the motions after that, you know, um, just. That's that the best way I can describe it. So what changed for you? What turned you on to CBD? Uh, I started, you know, just hearing about it and being in a state where CBD was legal for several years, you know, after two or three times it takes before, so, you know, it resonates with somebody, either the message or just hearing stories about how other people were, you know, prospering or thriving um, with uh, debilitating injuries. Right. You know, one day, you know, just getting out of bed was the first thing, noticing that I didn't have to hang my feet off to the edge let the blood rush back down to the feet and you know and then go up you know to use the restroom i was just up and out of bed and normally i'd be looking at the alarm clock like oh i got one more hour you know like thank god now i'm just like okay well i got an extra hour might as well jump on the computer hand her some emails you know just keep getting better and that's what it really did for me it was a snowball effect of positive you know uh, a chain of reaction of positive things just happening what are your nfl brethren saying to you about this or asking you about this Oh, they want to know what it is, and you know, obviously, well, they see me in the physical appearance, going from 275, 280 pounds, which you know, it's a tough look to pull off at 5'11". Uh, <laughs> so they see me, and they're like, "Yo, what are you doing?" And like, "What supplements?" What? I was like, "Yo, I replaced everything: anti-inflammatories, sleep, uh, sleep aids, uh, vitamins. All those vitamins I was taking, uh, glucosamine. I, I replaced them all with this one supplement." Do they believe you? Hey, I'm just going to keep doing it. I, mean, I just keep showing it. Just keep proving it. Yeah, that's quite the testimonial to yeah. go from not being able to get up to uh -huh. being able to do that. That's We're hearing a lot about yeah. that with CBD. I mean, there's a reason you're seeing it at your local drug stores like a Bartell Drugs. Mm -hmm. uh, last fall, they made a whole campaign to say, no, we want people to understand we're putting this on our end caps for a reason. This is an over-the-counter thing. It doesn't have psychoactive effects. You're yeah. not going to feel it. The way a nutritionist friend of mine explained it, and a lot of people will explain it, is you don't feel something, you just no longer feel something. If you've got those back pains a week from now, you might go, oh wow, you know what? I don't feel that back pain anymore. And that's a pretty exciting thing, certainly for people like these athletes who mm -hmm. take such a beating, and many of them don't even get to retire because they are simply so beat up. So that's pretty cool for Lofa. He's yeah. found yeah. something that works.